Why do we see conflict? Don't believe me? Well, I'll show you. Well, here's the scenario. You got a good woman, good man. You got a man who's been good. So far to his knowledge, he don't see a reason to have any type of side chick. He's just living his life. He's just doing what he thinks he's supposed to do. Working, taking care of kids. If you got kids. Taking care of the house. You know, all the other little stuff. You know, on the other hand, you got the woman. That's what she's supposed to be doing. Taking care of the kids, house, whatever. Long day at work for both of them. Regardless of the situation. Now, so life's great. He's doing what he's supposed to do. This is where the conflict comes in between those two. Just a scenario, by the way. Keep this in mind. Just a scenario. So the man notices that something may be wrong with his girl. So he like, what's the word? What's going on? He asks her what's wrong after asking her like, what's up, babe? You look upset. You okay? You good? What's wrong, babe? You stuff that dudes ask the chick. Nah. After all that, she seemed more irritated than before. He asks, do you want to be alone for a little? Do you need some space? The woman instantly answers with some bullshit. If I wanted to be alone, I would've said that. If I wanted to be alone, I would've said that. Now, this is where it goes wrong at. Because the man says, I was just asking a question. That's a response that's going to get his ass flamed the fuck up. When he should just walk away. If she responds to that though, more than likely she does need a minute alone. Don't play the role and be stuck thinking that like, that's love. Cause that's not love. Sorry boys and girls. Aww. That's not love. Aww. They may have some issues that they need to work out. Like sex may be good or whatever, but is it worth the hurt though? It ain't the pain and pleasure in sex. That's outside of sex. You know what I'm saying? Air is air, food is food, the rest is mental. So in a sense, we seeking conflict. I mean, that's all it seemed like. I used to always try to joke all the time and see a brighter side to the shitty life. Then one day realize there isn't a fucking bright side. I want you to keep in mind something though, right? If you stay woke and if you stay alert to what's going on, you'll realize that that's just a secret agenda to keep you all separate, keep you all apart from each other, keep you independent and worthless. You could be independent with a bunch of guns. But you're not going to be able to shoot a bunch of guns. You know what I'm saying? You could be independent with a bunch of kids. But you're not going to be able to just protect all them kids by yourself. Think about this, ladies and gentlemen. Because this is some real, real shit.